Okay, normally when you get a toggle bolt, you're going to have the long bolt, then you're going to have the little toggle up there. And the, the way this works, I'm, I'm sure most of you know, but you got to have a hole big enough for that to fit through, which that'll go through, and then once it goes through, spreads out on the other side, grabs a hold of that sheetrock, which we'll see in a minute. The only problem is, the head of the bolt is going to be flush against flush against the sheetrock. So with a hole like this, and if it's going to be covered up by a picture, you're going to have to get a nut that fits this bolt. Okay, get it down about where we want it. Then we need a washer on this side. It'll go down there and flut. And that way, when that tightens up, you've got this much screw sticking out to where you can hang your picture. So then we screw our toggle bolt on there. Pull it back. This up until you get as much bolt as you want sticking out. Run that nut up there to it. Tighten the nut up. And then you've got your picture hanging. Seems to be holding fine. Now let's go look at the back side of it. You can see how much area this covers more than the molly bolt did. Shows you how strong they are. One more of these I didn't show you. This is the wall anchors. These have been out, came out recently. And uh, these would replace a molly bolt when it messes up. Like when you drilled one out a few minutes ago. So you come through here and you've got that hole. So instead of going to a toggle bolt, set that in there. It's set for a Phillips screwdriver. And I like these because they're really flat against the surface. Then it's just a matter of putting your screw in there, and that's it. And of course, when this quits working, then we got to go back to our washer and a nut on the toggle bolt.